So this camper trailer here that they call the Cruiser High Side, this is really quick and easy to set up. The way the forward fold's designed is the actual floor of the camper trailer doesn't go down onto the, onto the ground, so everything is contained in the camper trailer itself. So it's just a matter of flipping it over, and there she is, pop up a couple of poles, good to go. I've been in a few caravans and stuff now, and a few camper trailers, and this is by far the most airiest and comfortablest I've been off-road. The bed's got a full-size mattress in it. It's fully fly-screened for the um, part where you sit down and eat your food, and it's also doubly fly-screened where the bed is. It's unreal. All right, Billy, you've dragged me down here, mate, to have a look at this new uh, Cruiser High Side. Yep. What's so different about this one, mate? It looks exactly the same as the one that uh, we used. You notice any winches on it? No. So the last one you winched open and you winched closed, yeah? Yeah, okay. We'll come up with something a little bit different. All right, let's have a so, look here. So, pop the over and catch off. Don't yeah. love it. Okay. Out you go. Hit the button. <laughs> look at that. That's pretty cool. That is so easy. It is very easy. It doesn't use much battery power, I bet. Nah. Quick too, it's not, not oh, it's very slow quick. Away it goes. Yeah. All the hard work's done, mate. It is. Right. Now we've got it open. Yeah. So we used to have the winch post and the little clip at the front. Yeah, there. yeah, and you pull that down. But around here we've got something different. Let's pull him down. Pull it down. Done. Tip. Finished. Job done. How cool is that? It is awesome. That is awesome. Cruiser High Side is my favourite ca camper trailer out of the whole range. Once you've opened up inside, they really are nice and high in the roof there. Again, you've got a huge amount of windows around there, so it makes it really nice and open and airy. You've got a queen size bed up the front there. Plus at the back there, the actual table drops down, converts into another big double bed area at the back there, so you can comfortably sleep all four of you in it. So we run aluminium boxes on the front there, not steel boxes. It cuts down a lot of the drawbar weight on there, and we've got the biggest that you'll actually fit in there. So you'll fit great big fridges in your fridge slide there. All of the boxes there have got push button LED strip lights as well, so you can actually see in there in the dark. It has got the best kitchen, so four burner stove. It's got a glass lid over the sink as well, so you can turn that back into bench space when you're not using it. You've got storage bins in there. It does come with the best kitchen that we just about offer in camper trailers. And of course, there's a full uh, room and annex to be clipped on there as well. This was one of my favourite uh, models because of the ease of setup, all the features it's got. It's got one of the best battery systems in it. Yep. It's definitely my favourite now because of that little thing right there. <laughs> the remote. <laughs> no, that's awesome, mate. That's very awesome. I was very impressed with the fact that the, the whole camper trailer was well made. It was also very strong, the suspension. Like, we have towed this sucker for the last 10 weeks into some of the roughest country in Australia, and it's still holding on. This thing, seriously, is a hardcore, full-on off-road camper trailer. By far, one of the best all-round packages you'll get. 